Hello students, welcome to my channel. Today we are going to solve fifth problem in our exercise 1.2 of our first chapter real numbers. Find the value of root 5 up to 3 decimals. So in our previous video already we have calculated the value of root 3 up to 6 decimals right. So in the same process here we have to calculate root 5 value up to 3 decimals. So, as I said earlier, here they asked up to 3 decimals. So, I wrote 3 pair of zeros and I put bar on them. Okay. And for to perform this division, we have to read the square table 1 into 1, 2 into 2, 3 into 3. Like this, we have to check the table. Okay, so now if we check, it is 2 into 2, 4 is near to this. Here we write quotient and here divisor. Okay, so I wrote 2 here, 2, 2 to the 4. So after subtracting, we get 5 minus 4, 1. So here decimal point is there. So, put decimal point here and now we can bring these zeros down. So, it is, now it is 100. So, in the second step, we wrote 2 here, the divisor, right? So, just add that 2, just add that 2 on, then it will become 4, okay? Now, here, 3 digits are there. Take first two digits, 4 to the 8, right? 4 to the 8, 4 3 the 12, it is more than 10. So, write 2 here, 2 here. Now, 42 2s, 42 2s, 2 to 4 and 2 4 the 8, it is 884, sorry, 84. After subtracting, 9 minus 8, 1. Again, we can bring next set of zeros down. So, now, in our last step, we wrote 2 here, right? So, this is 42, right? The What is the last digit here? 2 only, right? So, just add that 2. What is, what is the digit in units place? Just add that 2 only. Okay, 42 plus 2, 44. So, if we see, 4, 4 is a 16. Then, 440 something, 4 is a, it's more than 1600, right? 4, 3 is a 12, so 443 threes. 443 threes, if we check, this is... 1329. So, right here. So, after subtracting 10 minus 9, 1, 9 minus 2, 7, 5 minus 3, 2. Just write another set of zeros down. So, here 3 is there in units place, right? Just add that 3 again. We wrote 3 only now in the quotient. So, add that. So, if this value 446. It is 446. Now, 4, 6, 24, right? 4, 6, 24. So, we we'll check 4,466, 6, 6, 6 6 6 is a 36, 6 6 is a 36 plus 3 39, 6 4 is a 24 plus 3 27, again 24 plus 3 27. So it is 27,000. 6 4 is a 24 and 2 will be there, no? So this is 26 only. So write 6. 
this is 26796 after subtracting we get Ten minus six, four, zero, three. Okay, so just they asked up to three decimals. So enough. So now we can write. Therefore, square root of 5 is equal to 2.236. So, up to 3 decimals, we calculate it. So, I think you understand this problem. Please like this video and share with your friends. And please subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.